Hello everybody and welcome to Panic Basket's playthrough of Dark Souls 2. In this playthrough we're going to be building a character for PvP so we can have some future PvP videos. It's going to be a, a Sephiroth type character so I'm going to start a new character. <coughs> and I am going to start a timer because I want these videos to be Perhaps roughly 30 minutes wrong. I'll be quiet. Maybe or I'll just skip this. Dream. Everybody's seen this shit. So we're gonna be basically doing a Dex character that can cast hexes for the weapon buff, the hex weapon buff. I forget what it's called. So gonna be choosing a starting quest that has roughly the same amount or actually I don't actually quite know the stats needed for the resonate weapon is what it's called so I guess while these people are talking I'll look it up on my phone Sites never work on on the phone. It makes me upset. Skip these ladies' dialogue. Recall my name. How do you? Sp oh God! I'm so unprepared. S e p h i r o t h. Sorry about that, my recording button is actually R, so it stopped my recording, but we will continue. And we'll start as a cleric, because they start with decent faith. Gift, petrified something, body, gender, male, build, good for this, physique, muscly as fuck, face, no, advanced, no, hair, oh that's, that's pretty dope for Sephiroth. Eye color. That's fine. Beard. No. Alright. It's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Now we can start. Start with a mace that you can't use with one hand. But this mace is a pretty dope starting weapon. It does decent damage. Okay. I'm gonna go get the stone plate ring. It's not that way. And I'm not gonna rest that bonfire because I'm completely confident in my ability to take out this Cyclops man. 
So if I die, I will look like a fool. But he shouldn't be a problem. I've killed him enough times. Oh, oh god. I might die. Get behind you, Doug. Oh no. Oh Jesus. If he would have chose the right move there, he would have destroyed me. Okay. So we got the stone plate ring. Nice. And we will continue. I'm not gonna heal, I'll just rest that bonfire. So when this build is done, it will have make some PvP videos because I have a friend that is making a, a cloud build, so it'll be pretty sweet. So I'll rest at this. Whatever this is. Come on, break it. There you go. Okay. Torch. Handy, I guess. And we'll continue through here. To get this ladder down. To trade that petrified something that I got. As you can see, the mace is pretty dope starting out. It's one of the easy this is one of the easier classes to start out as. I don't know what it is about the mace. It makes it so awesome. Continue through here. I'm pretty sure there's an achievement if you light all those uh braziers. Dagger. Never gonna use it. You ass. Alright. Oh, this guy. And we will continue. This place is pretty straightforward. Tired of getting shot through the head with arrows. The aim in this game is so much better than Demon Souls or Dark Souls. Went, bla went back and ta played uh, Demon Souls quite recently, and I don't think I got shot once because it was so easy to dodge. All the shots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take it. Give me, some give me something crappy like I know you're going to. Yeah, ten nights slab, useless. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <gasps> oh my god. Good thing I got heal. That could have easily killed me. And it almost did. So we'll go back to two hand in our mace here. this tree down. Nothing. Kill that guy. Anybody else down here? No. Blap blap. Click clack. The guns are coming out. Through the fog. And 
This is the way to get to the coffin to change your gender and also to get the ladle. If you kill those two cyclopses and you go talk to the ladies in red, they'll give you the ladle. It's pretty useless, but it's fun to have, I guess. If you hit them when they're swinging you, you get a special critical on them. Which is why sometimes I kill these guys in one hit and sometimes I don't. Come, come on. Amber herb is useful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it. I'm gonna eat a life gem here, just so I don't die from this fall. Nice. Open the door. Crack red eye orb. Be fun a little later on. I don't think you can invade the people here. If you could, that'd be fun. Just a bunch of noobs invading each other. What is this? I didn't get this. Soul of an aimless soldier. And that's it. Now we're on to Majula. I'm gonna try and make pretty quick work of this playthrough. Cause I don't wanna have Well I don't I don't wanna be Ghost Robo if you've if you've seen his work. Ninety part let's let's play of Dark Souls one. But he he was triumphant in the end, so that's good. It's just not that entertaining to watch. Shots fired. Okay. Majula bonfire. Excellent. We'll spend a little time here collecting all the crap there is to get. And I might miss some things, but it doesn't concern me very much. Life gem. Useful. Get this Estes flask shard here. And I think we're going to be going to Hades Tower first. Just because the girl that sells mil miracles is there. And. I don't know. I this isn't supposed to be a miracle character, it's supposed to be a hex character. So I don't know if I'm actually It's just not a faith build. So I, don't, I need to get that out of my head. That's what I'm used to making. Um Might as well get the binoculars. Cause those are useful. If I remember, oh, is this no? It's right here. There we are. Morning star. And the I knows. Alright, let's go. Well, let's actually enforce our SS flask first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. 
כמה? כמה? I'm actually not gonna level up yet. I'm not gonna level up this episode because I need to know the stats I need for the spells I'm gonna get. Alrighty. To Hades Tower. Which is this way, I'm pretty sure. I get lost in the beginning sometimes because places connect weirdly. But we will go. And there's a shield in here that I'm not going to use, but I will get because I will use a shield at one point. This one's not going to be the one I use, though, but I like to have it. Breaking Thief Sword. Useless. Hades Tower of Flame. This first guy can be a problem, because if he kills you, then you have to go all the way back. But I, I presume he won't be. You do crazy damage to him in the beginning. Oh. Yep. Cleric's one of the easiest characters to start with. Bonfire lit. Bonfire rest of it. I don't think you actually have to rest at the bonfire in this game to spawn back at it. Like you did in Dark Souls 1. Blap, blap. And cracked blue eye orb. Never gonna have a shortage of those. This guy's pretty tough, actually. Okay, he's dead. Dropped Sublime Bone Dust. Which, like he always does, he always drops that. Human Effigy there. Dead. Lloyd's Talisman. Never got a ton of use out of it. And we will be summoning people because, you know, it's fun to get some co op in here. I'm completely able to destroy all these bosses by myself, but I like to get people in on it. Share the fun. Shot that guy. Alright, this can sometimes be a problem. Having the two dudes. But they do like to fight you one on one. They're polite about it. See, so after this guy's dead, then this guy will come back. Actually, not. Just ran back to his doorway. Fake me at. Alright. Old Knight 
leggings, cool. Don't expect to have the equip weight to wear super heavy armor like that. Probably gonna be wearing the jacket from those stone horse dudes. And you go pull this lever. From the stone horse dudes before the looking glass night. But when I am gonna farm items, I will make a video out of me getting like a few of the items that I need. Just so it's not like, watch me farm this guy until I get this and then the video's over. And if I have to fight somebody for too long, I will edit out some of it. Because it's hard to come up with coherent commentary when you're just farming something. Alright. Some pale stone here. And I'll open this chest. Green blossom. Masterless Glencore. Avati. Alright. Come on, guy. Let's do this. There's no signs here, so I'm just gonna go in with this dude. Now, you have to be pretty good at dodging this first boss. Because you don't have a shield. Staggered him, nice. Blap, blap, blap. Oh, he did the backhand. I'm gonna heal quickly. And I probably don't need it, but better safe than sorry. Nice. Thank you. Goodbye. Alright, so that's Dragon Rider done. And if there are signs that Ornst old not Ornstein, old Dragon Slayer. And we will go kill him quickly as well. Talk to the miracle lady. Are you from this? My name no. is Lysia. Okay. I have come to spread the yep. I can see that you mm -hmm. have the cost of it. The cost. So I don't need a f I don't know if I'm gonna need 22 faith for this, so I'm not gonna pick it up right now. No need so I will leave her. You're a scrimper. Call me a scrimper. Okay, so we'll go fight old Dragon Slayer now. Easy. I'm doing this mainly to acquire the holy water, which makes the it makes the Urn Sentinel fight much easier. Just spam them with holy water. I've not put Estus on my quick bar yet. There we go. What did this guy drop? Crack blue eye orb? Yep.
Come on, man. I got you. You ain't never gonna hit nothing with that sword. Never mind. I'm an idiot. Stone. Don't exactly know what Pale Stone does. Might have something to do with magic, you asshole. There we go. Pick this stuff up down here. Blessings. Divine blessing. Excuse me. And I am going to put my essence on my hot bar here. Alrighty. And this man must perish. on this thing, right? Absolutely. Alright, that's, that's enough of that. Watch the waggly chains come down. And you can see these chains go, chains go from looking sweet right here to like, just flat. Right there. Just flat. Sweet. Flat. Okay. Crack blue eye orb. Now this is the one fight that I might not be too sure of. But it must be done. No science, so I'm going in solo. Ring of binding. Might as well throw that on. Alright, let's do it. Oh god, this isn't good. <laughs> Gives you a pretty good opening every time he attacks you to heal. Pretty intense fight. That's my timer, so after this boss, this video is complete. Uh, 
Oh shit. Oh, I'm done. Yep. <laughs> Alright guys, thanks for watching this, and in the next video we will be giving this another go. And if I die again, I'll probably just move on. Need to get the stats I need for some things marked down. So thanks for watching, and stay tuned for the next one.